Okay, I gotta give Biden credit for this. Armenians celebrate. Turkey condemns Biden's decision to recognize genocide. Anybody that recognizes the genocide of the Armenian people, I have to freaking commend them because it's true. Turkey murdered a bunch of fucking Armenians. Jerusalem, Israel. For the first time, an American president has officially recognized the Armenian genocide from the early 1900s. While the announcement led to much jubilation, it also sparked condemnation from Turkey. Ah, Turkey can kiss my ass. For years, the White House recognized Armenian Remembrance Day while avoiding the term genocide, mainly to steer clear of potentially alienating Turkey in NATO ally. Oh man, call it what it is. That's it, exactly what it is. The government killed a bunch of Armenian people. Death by the government is genocide. President Joe Biden changed that when he said in a statement on Saturday, each year on this day we remember the lives of all those who died in the Ottoman era Armenian genocide and recommit ourselves to preventing such an atrocity from ever happening, ever occurring again. American Armenians held the decision as they see it long overdue. Hey, I, I, that should have been done when Trump was president. Trump's so much of a savior to everybody, why didn't he do this? We worked very hard to see America recognize the Armenian Genocide, and this is a new beginning for us. I feel it is a new beginning for my children. Uh, good luck, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. An Armenian American told the Associated Press. I don't want to try to pronounce the man's name because I would butcher it and I don't want to disrespect him. On Twitter, Turkey's foreign minister condemned the declaration, writing words, cannot change or rewrite history and Turkey entirely rejects it. <laughs> what do you reject? That you, whatever. Beginning in April 1915, Ottoman authorities deported, massacred, or marched to death 1.5 million Armenians in the first mass exterminations of the 20th century. Turkey doesn't deny the deaths from that era, but refuses to call it a genocide. The government maintains the death toll is inflated, and it is the result of civil unrest. During a ceremony in Armenia, Armenia's Prime Minister called Biden's statement a powerful step in the way of acknowledging the truth. The White House's acknowledgement will likely cast chilling impact on U.S.-Turkish relations. Turkey's Foreign Ministry said it would open a deep wound that undermines mutual trust and friendship. Oh man. For now, Armenians worldwide feel a historic injustice is being righted. Thank God for our president and must have had some kind of guts between all those presidents that all he gets up and he accepts the genocide said, yeah, say I'm not going to try to pronounce that, 74, a grandson of a genocide victim. And this came from the Christian Perspective CBN News. I will leave it there. Thank you.